friends today i am going to tell you the history of meteoric rise of julan goswami the legendary indian pace bowler if you have grown up in this generation chances are there that you have at least once stumbled upon the name of julan nisit goswami fastest bowler in the women's circuit at the peak of her career goswami now sits atop the leading wicket takers list in odi history yes an indian pace bowler did it it is often said that cricket is a batter's game not often would you see a bowler making the headlines or hitting the cover pages of magazines or front pages of newspapers despite this fact there are still a number of aspiring cricketers who want to take up the thankless job of a bowler and put their blood and sweat together to play the sport at the highest level one such bowler who has toiled hard and literally gone those extra miles to realize a dream of playing cricket for india is none other than julan goswami over her illustrious career stretching beyond 20 years goswami has not only made india proud but also inspired a brand of new generation cricketers to take up fast bowling as their career she was born in chakda west bengal on 25th november 1982 her nickname is babul in the arena of international cricket she is familiar as chakda express from being a ball girl in the 1997 world cup final to a legendary cricketer with a glorious career spanning over 15 years at the highest level of cricket smitten by the cricket bug the lanky teenager traveled 2 hours in a crowded local train for practice in kolkata before catching up the studies back in her hometown chakda she did it thrice in a week her tall frame convinced her coach that she has every quality of a fearsome pace bowler and her parents were also convinced once the parents were roped in there has been no looking back ever since having started of a pure bowler goswami slowly but steadily earned the reputation of india's leading all-rounder with some handy contributions with the bat lower down the batting order goswami backed the icc women's cricketer of the year award in 2007 and captaincy came calling soon after though she has enjoyed moderate success rate as the indian captain standing at 5 ft 11 in height she can be very intimidating but her aggression comes to the fore only on field sledging is not her idea of fierceness and unwavering line and length remain the most potent weapon in her repertory those who have seen her from the close quarters vouch for the fact that her dedication towards the game work ethic and willingness to learn is second to none if the bcci were to institute a hall of fame for women's cricket in india julan goswami would certainly feature in it a decade and a half since bursting onto the scene goswami one of the fastest bowler in the women's game till not too long ago has ripped rewards through control and minute deviations of the pitch in may she surpassed katherine fitzpatrick to become the highest wicket taker in women's international one day history now she doubles up as a mentor to a young group of fast bowlers coming through the ranks in india she was earmarked for a leadership role when she was named vice captain of the national team ahead of the tour of england back in the year 2006 There she helped India to the test series win including their first victory against England making a 50 as a night watchman in the first test at the Lister and taking her career best match figures 10 for 78 5 for 33 in the first innings and 5 for 45 in the second innings in the second test at Taunton such feats made her the player of the series and also brought recognition at the castrol awards in mumbai in september in that year where she received a special award further to that 
She won the ICC Women Player of the Year award in 2007, a year no Indian male cricketer bagged any individual award. Soon after, she was elevated as captain of the national team. Then in 2010, she was conferred with the prestigious Arjuna Award. In the year 2012, a Padma Shri Award was conferred to him. Bowling exploits aside, Goswami is a more than handy lower order batsman. Goswami partnered Mithali Raj for a better part of a record breaking 2 1 4 against England at Taunton in 2002. The pair added 157 with Goswami chipping in with 62. England was also the scene of India's one off test win in 2014, where Goswami triggered the host slide with a four-wicket haul to set up the win. In 2015, she was one of the four senior players who were handed the highest grade of central contracts by the BCCI for the first time. She played her last one-day international match on 22nd March 2022. The glorious journey of one of the most Fearsful and fastest pace bowler of India and of the world has come to an end. Her biopic starring Anushka Sharma titled Chak the Express has been streaming on Netflix. She is definitely one of the greatest cricketers of all time of India and also in international cricket.